this is um, kind of a quick review, kind of a dirty review of a of a blue Yeti microphone. Now, as I'm videoing this, it's backwards, mirror imaged the wrong direction, so I don't know whether it's going to come out that way or not. But anyway, it's actually Y E T I Yeti, and it's blue. Uh, it's the silver microphone cute little box various things this is the actual microphone here that you see right here got it okay uh, that's the front of the microphone there so. it has this little mute button on it so I can click that couldn't hear a word I'm saying because it's mute Very good. So, um, anyway I wanted to, to I got this um, uh, my wife got it for me for my birthday. Uh, it's a very professional uh, looking microphone, very professional acting microphone. It produces good uh, good quality sound. But I wanted to toy with it a little bit because it's actually got four modes on it. <coughs> uh, you may not be able to see this, I don't know. But it's got um, these four modes. Um, stereo, cardioid, omnidirectional, and bidirectional. And so I've been playing around with it a little bit that's controlled by this little switch right here on the back of on the back of the uh, microphone there's a, a if you have your earphones plugged into to monitor uh, there's a volume switch on the front that actually a volume switch on the front that actually um, controls the volume into your your headset so uh, and I'm not set up for for any kind of you know professional recording right now uh, I'm on a hardwood table so you're going to hear a bunch of knocks and and when I move this you're going to hear that kind of stuff sorry about that but this is like I said just kind of a quick down and dirty thing that I wanted to, to review because I I'm really impressed with this microphone so uh, at the moment I am set to bi-directional bi-directional it's got that little symbol right there and it's and it uh, records on the front side of the mic and the back side of the mic ignoring the kind of sides left and right so that's the front that's the back left and right are not nearly as uh, uh, sound producing right left back front so that's the uh, that's the uh, bi-directional uh, the next this other setting is Cardioid. Cardioid right there. And its primary design is to, to record off of the front of the microphone only. And when you take this with kind of a grain of salt, you're going to get recording going to the microphone no matter what direction you're at, but it's going to concentrate the recording on the front of the microphone. So we've got front, left, right, left, back front so if I were to record if I were to rotate this around while I'm talking you're going to kind of get this effect where it sounds like I'm talking in a can because the microphone capsule is uh, for the front of the uh, microphone wasn't facing me all the time so that's cardioid let's go to the next setting omnidirectional it's going to pick up noise pick up sound from anywhere 360 degrees Okay, so all the way around. So if I if I spin this, you should pretty much hear me evenly, no matter which way this this microphone is uh, facing. So uh, that's uh, omnidirectional. No, oh, did I show you the symbol for that? Hold on. Omnidirectional, right there. Should match the little symbol right there. Okay, and then the last one we have. Stereo. Now, there's a symbol for stereo. Okay. Um, stereo, a little bit in the front, right, left, and right, and not so much in the back. So we've got front, got right, got left, and we've got back. Now, unless you're wearing 
stereo headphones or are on a, using a stereo speaker system, this isn't going to make much sense to you because you're going to hear mono, so it may not make a difference. But uh, so as I talk, this is the left side of the microphone, and you should hear it in your left side. Uh, this is the back of the microphone, and it diminishes my voice by quite a bit. We'll rotate back around to the right side, and it should be coming into your right channel. And then we're back around to the front of the microphone. So, anyway, I wanted to just kind of demonstrate the four modes of this Yeti, uh, Yeti, Blue Yeti uh, microphone. Uh, it's heavy. Uh, oh, here, let me spin this back around. I really wish I kind of had it on a turntable here. I'm going to switch this over to cardio it too. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so now you should be hearing. Yeah, now you should be hearing me. Okay. Um, so anyway, uh, it's a it's a really nice microphone. Um, I can see uh, I can see doing some really good uh, broadcasting with this. It's uh, uh, oh, by the way, I got to explain uh, the camera that I'm using right now to do this is my camera on my um, the screen of my computer. Uh, while it's a good computer, it's an Asus Q534. It seems like the camera's kind of crappy because I'm I'm not seeing myself right here. I'm not focused. My face doesn't seem to be focused. Everything back here seems to be in great focus. But from what I'm seeing, my face isn't focused, and I can't figure out. Like I said, as I'm looking at it, first aid. Well, where is it? There it is. There. First aid uh, is written backwards, and when I got Yeti up here, Yeti's written backwards. Uh, if in post I'm able to actually get that flipped around, or if it flips around on its own, great. Then it'll look okay. But um, camera not so great uh, on on the uh, Asus or Asus Asus A S U S. Q534. Love the computer though. Plenty of power. It's um, a two-in-one. Folds back. Becomes a tablet. Nice size. Plenty of uh, RAM. It is just a great computer. I love the screen for the most part. It's a very um, uh, uh, high-resolution screen. That's great for the most part, but uh, for some programs it makes the print a little, little, little tiny and my eyes are getting old. I'll just turn ancient yesterday um this is august 13th and i was birthday was on august 12th but anyway um but enough about the asus um I, this is about the microphone today so uh, if you have uh, a hankering to do broadcasting or video recording or whatnot and you want a good microphone um this, this yeti uh is, is great um, oh, in case I didn't show you, and I don't think I did, it's uh, actually got, uh, oh, well, here, let me lean it back this way. It's actually got uh, standard threading, so you can put it on a mic stand, a uh, regular mic stand, or you can put it on a little articulating arm or whatever. The, the, uh, the stand that it's on has cable management running through the back of it, as you can see there. Um, it's got these little... Um, knobs on it that, that you turn to, to uh, tighten it up so it doesn't flop around all over the place. And if you, you know, I don't know whether I can demonstrate this, I'm going to, can I demonstrate this? No, I don't think I can. Uh, what you can, you can take the microphone, um, if you're going to store, it is, it's a fairly big microphone, you can take the microphone and, and flip it upside down into the, into the uh, stand like that and it makes it much smaller for storage and whatnot. So, um, and again, my, my apologies for all this groaning and finger picking and all that kind of stuff that you can hear going on with the microphone. But like I said, wasn't really, uh, I didn't really set up to do this. It's just kind of spur of the moment review because uh, this first I've used this microphone. Uh, I've had it uh, for a few days and I, I didn't. Uh, was kind of nervous about breaking it out because I wasn't really sure about the quality of the microphone. <laughs> I'm sure now. So anyway, look, thank you very much for watching. Uh, for those of you who, who do watch, uh, you're welcome to pass it along uh, for, you know, review purposes or whatnot. But but that's my uh, my down and dirty review of the, uh, of the Blue Yeti Ultimate Professional USB microphone. Oh, yeah, in case I didn't tell you, it plugs into your standard USB port. Uh, 3.0, 2.0, just plugged right in. So anyway, that's it for now. We'll do more later.